In this video, I'm going to show you how to get rid of gout naturally in 24 hours. Few things in life are more painful than a gout attack, so if you're awakened in the early hours by a joint that is tender, swollen, red, and radiating heat, you'll want to act fast. Gout is a type of arthritis that can affect different body parts like the ankles, knees, hands, wrists, but mainly affects the big toe. Symptoms include pain, inflammation in the joints, causing swelling and tenderness. Here's what you can do when a gout attack starts to ease the pain of the attack quickly and to reduce the risk of other gout attacks. These are the most popular natural health remedies as voted by gout sufferers, the top three being especially helpful. Number one, apple cider vinegar. Apple cider vinegar is considered king when it comes to gout natural home remedies. Apple cider vinegar helps your body become more alkaline and the acidity helps relieve acute gout pain. Many gout sufferers report drinking one to two tablespoons of raw, unfiltered and organic apple cider vinegar in a glass of at least eight ounces of water. Some will drink this two to three times a day for the best results. Apple cider vinegar can also be used as a topical treatment. You can soak your foot for about 30 minutes in a bucket full of four cups of hot water and one cup of apple cider vinegar. You can also soak a clean dry cloth in apple cider vinegar and wrap it around the affected area for about 15 minutes. Number two, baking soda. Another extremely popular natural home remedy for gout sufferers is baking soda. Like apple cider vinegar, it makes your body more alkaline. Many consume half a teaspoon in a glass of eight ounces of water. Many will repeat this throughout the day until they've consumed at least three teaspoons of baking soda. Baking soda helps to lower uric acid, providing relief from the pain at the same time. Avoid this home remedy if you're suffering from high blood pressure and try to limit salt intake in your meals throughout the day when taking baking soda. Baking soda is also very high in sodium. The maximum recommended dose is four teaspoons throughout the whole day. Number three, cherries. Whether sweet or sour, cherries have been known to be extremely effective in treating gout and lowering uric acid due to their high antioxidant properties. In one study conducted with 600 people suffering from gout, it was concluded that eating half a cup serving of cherries daily, that's about 10 to 12 cherries, resulted in a 35% reduced risk of successive gout attacks. For those eating two or even three servings a day, the risk dropped to 50%. Number four, ginger and or turmeric. The powerful anti-inflammatories present in ginger root and turmeric can be very helpful in easing gout pain and inflammation. Basically, all you need to do is chop off a little piece the size of an inch and boil it for about 20 minutes and then drink it as a tea. You can also add ginger root or turmeric in cooking recipes. Some may also eat small pieces raw daily. Others use it topically to reduce swelling by making a paste of ginger root with water and then apply it to the affected area, leaving it on for about 30 minutes. Number five, water. Very simple and we all have it and it's free drinking plenty of it and flush excessive uric acid out of your body. Staying hydrated is one of the most effective ways of limiting gout flare-ups. Drink at least eight glasses of water a day, but if you can, why not strive for 12? Make sure a water bottle is with you everywhere you go. Number six, lemon juice. Another natural home remedy that helps alkalize your body thus reducing uric acid in the blood. Many gout sufferers squeeze half a lemon in a glass of eight ounces of water and drink it up to three times a day. Others will combine it with half a teaspoon of baking soda. Remember, lemon juice is also high in vitamin C, which also helps gout. Number seven, celery seeds. Another popular natural home remedy that helps lower uric acid and prevent gout, according to many gout sufferers, is celery seed extracts. Celery seed simply stimulates your kidneys, causing your kidneys to excrete more uric acid out of the body. Thus it causes you to visit the bathroom and urinate more. Number eight, Epsom salts. There is no better topical treatments to treat gout attacks than Epsom salts, widely used by many to relax muscles, aches and pains. The presence of magnesium, which is an alkaline mineral in Epsom salt, also helps to treat gout. Before taking a bath, simply add one to two cups of Epsom salt to your bath, 
and soak your entire body or the affected joint for at least 30 minutes. Number 9. Bromelain Bromelain is a compound found in pineapples. The enzymes within it are frequently recommended for gout sufferers since it can lower uric acid and ease inflammation caused by gout. Again, bromelain is loaded with vitamin C as well, which is good for your gout. Bromelain is also considered a natural painkiller for those with ailments. Number 10. Vitamin C A very popular vitamin with gout sufferers, let's not forget vitamin C. Numerous studies have shown how vitamin C is effective in lowering uric acid levels in your blood. Finally, don't forget to rest your effective joints when suffering from gout as much as you can, and do not overuse it so you can heal faster. Minimise the time spent on your joints. You can also ice your joints if you like for temporary pain relief. Apply an ice pack to help ease pain and inflammation several times a day for about 20 to 30 minutes each time. Elevating your foot also helps to ease the pain, causing the blood to flow to that particular area of the body. Don't be shy and use a cane to walk around, thus avoiding unnecessary pressure on the affected joint. Here are a few other common sense things you can do to ease the pain as well. You need to avoid the alcohol. Although it may be tempting to have a drink to relax when you're in pain, it's important to avoid alcohol, especially beer, which contains high levels of purines. The body creates uric acid when it metabolizes purines. Furthermore, alcohol inhibits the excretion of uric acid from your body. You need to tame your bed sheets as well. Even the weight of your bed sheets can be unbearable to an inflamed, gouty toe. Tuck the sheet in on the side so its end falls at calf level, leaving your painful toe free. You can also create gout-friendly socks. Cut the big toe out of the cheap socks or cut the toe section off completely so you can have warm feet without the toe pain. You also need to chill out. Try to relax if you can. Stress can aggravate gout. Watch a movie, talk to a friend, read a book or listen to some music. Finally, try to revamp your menu. Stop eating troublesome high purine foods such as shellfish, red meat, sweetbreads and sugary foods. If you have frequent attacks or tests show that you have high levels of uric acid in your blood, your doctor might prescribe medication. This is used to lower levels of uric acid and needs to be taken long term. There are things that can trigger a gout attack as well. You might get an attack if you're stressed or have an illness. If you injure or bruise a joint, and it's more painful than you would expect after a minor bump, there could be an attack coming on. Get treatment straight away if you do feel an attack coming on. You may also be wondering who gets gout. Well, gout sometimes runs in families. It's more common in men, especially as they get older. Other people at risk include women after the menopause, people who take medications such as diuretics, that's water tablets, for blood pressure or high levels of cholesterol, and people who are overweight, and who drink alcohol, especially beer. There are also complications of gout. It's rare to get a lot of attacks, but if you do, you can develop permanent damage to the joint. Chronic gout also causes tiny white lumps to appear under your skin, especially on your ears, fingers or elbows. This is where urate crystals from under the skin can be painful. You can also get kidney stones if your uric acid levels are too high, so you'll definitely need to get treatment to reduce the levels. I hope you've enjoyed this video on how to get rid of gout naturally in 24 hours. And if you have, please subscribe and give this video the thumbs up. And if you want more information, then watch this video on how to lower uric acid naturally. Thanks for watching and bye for now.